What isn't it? How? Life is so responsive to a point of view that you please hear my words when I say to you that everything you do, do with all your heart. And if it happens that sometimes you are close to me and sometimes you are far away, just always do it with all your heart. Because your heart is the heart of you that will continue to smile and say, well, isn't that interesting today? Isn't that interesting today? How the world will stay in lockstep with the consciousness of man, you see? Because when man thinks of something, the world will think of it too. And it will say, well, that's a good idea. That's what I'll do. That's what I'll do. And if you love me, then just see the world the way you want it to be. And then it will be as you want to be. Because you will be in the world, you see. And you will be in the world as you want to be. If you want to be rich, then be rich with all your heart. If you want to be poor, then be poor with all your heart. If you want to be the one who can see me. Everywhere you look, then see me. Everywhere you look, with all your heart. And if you love the world, then love the world with all your heart. And if the world should come apart, then start fresh. Okay, I'm going to throw myself on the wind today. And wherever it takes me, it takes me. And then I will see a new reality because I will see that everything is different today than it was yesterday. Everything is different today than it was yesterday. And that makes me say, hooray, hooray, because yesterday is gone, you see, and it never can bother me again. Today is here, and I wonder where I will land. Because I'm going to throw myself on the wind today, and it will take me into the promised land. The promised land. I wonder what, I wonder how I could understand the promised land. What is the promise? The promise that it will always be what you see? You will always get what you give? Promise me the world you see. Promise me that you will see the world I give you with love. And you will see the promised land you see. The promised land is a promise you make to me to see the world in a way that makes you say, Thank you, God, for my present today. Thank you for the promised land. Thank you for taking my hand. Thank you for all you have given me. Thank you for the world I see. For today, I came to see a new reality. And if I 
Trust on you. I will see you. Trust on me. And I will be excited. Because I will think of a you. And I will say, she trusted on me today. She trusted on me today. And if I go away, she will say, oh, I forgot to trust on God today. I forgot to say, God, thank you for being here. And when you go away, it's because I go away. I go away from you. And I forget that you are the one who always knew the way. You always knew the way to play in the promised land. And all I have to do is remember to throw myself on the wind and you will carry me to the place where I need to be. And uh, you will set me down so gently and you will whisper in my ear and say, I love you today and I will love you back, you see. I will love you today in the same way that you love me because I'll be your child, you see. And I will look around me and say, Hey, I cannot see you today except through the gifts you give me. I see you in the gifts all around me. Thank you, God, today for allowing me to play in the promised land today. Then you will always stay close to me, and I will be your father, you see. I will take your hand and show you how happy we can be, because we'll sing in the rain, you see, and we'll dance in the sunshine, and we will thank our lucky stars that we have stars in the sky at night. We will say, I think I'd like to play this way forever and a day. I think I'd like to play this way when you and I are so happy, you see, that we just say, I love my world today. I love my world today. Thank you, God. That's very kind and reassuring that it's kind. It feels kind. Kind is the state of mind of the one who can see that I can be a friend who will come to you in your moment of need and say to you, I am here, I am here, what you need, my dear. And when you come to me and you say, I feel a little strange today because things have changed a bit, you see. And then I will say, well, if you think I will ever leave you, then we will never be completely free of anxiety. And so when my children go their ways, they have other days together but they have to gather together again in a different way. Because my children, you see, like to come and go because they like to be free, to fly on the wind and to say, today I want to fly on the wind and see where I land. Because it's always the promised land when I land, wherever I land. Because you made a promise to me, God. You promised me that you would always be here to guide me and to say, Hey, it's a beautiful day today. It's a beautiful day today. Don't mind the noise of the guns. Don't play the way the people do when they say, God has abandoned me today. God has never abandoned you. You have abandoned God, you see, when you get God out of the promised land. The promised land, you see, is the promise that we keep. When we get up every day and say, 
I love you today. I love you today. And it doesn't matter that you say it to your dog or your wife or husband or your child or the angel comes to you. It only matters that you do, that you love someone. Because when you love any of my children, you see, you love me and I can see that I love you as much as you love me because we will always be hand in hand, you see. Thank you for that today. You're welcome, my dear. Stay close to me and I will stay close to you. And if you throw yourself on the wind, I'll be there to carry you to the place where you will be. A trust on me and a trust on your reality and a trust that all you, on all you see and a trust will set you free because a trust is the inheritance that I gave to you that every day you would have a reality that was sufficient for you to see that God is in his heavens and that the ones who would take away your inheritance are the ones who have forgotten me because they've forgotten that they have a trust that is equal to your own. They have forgotten that God does own reality and that he sets aside enough material comfort for every one of his children as long as they don't try to steal from their neighbor, you see. Because when they try to steal from their neighbor, they steal from me. And I can see that love, that only love will set them free. Only love will set them free. Thank you.